Hello and welcome to Back to Way Pit. Today I'm going to do something a little different, something very special after learning some very talented young children have been writing some ZX Spectrum games. A school in Glasgow, Beersden Primary School, have coded some very special new games. These children are aged between 10 and 11 years old and they've been using John Caldwell's arcade game designer software. And you have to admire these kids, the, you know, they're 10, 11 years old and they're getting right involved with old computer systems from the 80s, learning how to do basic coding along with debugging software they've written. Animation and level design was all part of their remittance and they've created, even created their own loading screens and learned how to attach these to the games before they load. So I'm going to give these a go and see what they're like and I'm really looking forward to having a go with these. Now we're going to pick out a few of these at random, so I won't have time to do them all. Let's try Barbara Run. Oh, hang on, I know what I've done here. I've loaded this in 48k mode. These games must run in 128k mode for them to work. I'm actually using my Spectrum Nix to uh, run these on, so I'll run it in 128k mode and it should load up. There we go. There's a couple of options there as well for joystick and keyboard. And George looks like he's trying to run away from his crazy ex. It looks like I've got to work my way up these steps without being caught by this flying buddy. I'll make it over here without being struck by uh, the flying baddies. I'm trying to negotiate my way up these uh, steps. I've not played these before, this is my first time playing these. It looks a very interesting little platformer. Now what happens here? Do I, do I jump down? Will that kill me? No, I can carry on, that's okay. You know what? This game works. Oh, no, I think I've killed myself. Okay, well, I'm only going to give these games a very quick try. Let's go pick something else, to be fair. And again, I, I, let's try this one. Bunny versus Bears. Oh, I like the loading screen on this one. Okay, we go for option two for Kempston. Okay, what have we got to do here? I imagine the uh, ground underneath is dangerous. We must work away across the levels. I like this. You've got to be very precise where you jump. And there's a few obstacles to avoid as well. Yeah, I didn't last very long there, did I? Right, let's try again. It's got to all be timed right. This is good. Okay, this is going to be tight. Yeah, this one's challenging me. Well done, kids. I am really impressed. I can't believe young 10, 11 year olds of, in today's world are coding this well on old technology. Oops, yep, I'm dead. This is, this is tight. I like a challenge. Okay, we're getting up a few levels here. I 
Looks like he's keeping account of my lives as well on the right. jump that just in case the bear dimension okay jump that and, oh so it's going to drop down there no oh, is that a ladder every screen is totally different definitely been some thought put into this game. Oops. I'm not doing very well there. Okay, well let's move on to the next game. Well done on that one, that's a good game. Now which one shall we try? Egg run. Go on, let's keep let's try this. Love that. And we're getting some instructions as well in gameplay, a bit of a story here going on here. with his gassy butt. <laughs> Oops, I didn't ask. It. Yep, I have to be very careful where I jump here. Careful control. I think some thoughts been put into this game to uh, challenge the player. Ah, this is interesting. At the top of the screen there's a key. And the first time I've uh, seen one of these games where you have to pick something up. I'm sure there are other games within this uh, collection from these kids that you have to pick things up. But this is the first time me trying one out. Yeah, and that opens up a door over here. Very good. Okay, this is... Uh, Oop. That looked quite difficult. Okay, is that yellow face to walk on? Yes. Are oh, we getting messages in the game now? Are we? Are we done? Is this the end of the game? No. <laughs> Oh, where am I? Oh, I'm at the top. I like this. You know what? I think I could come back and try and complete some of these games uh, one afternoon. Ooh, have we completed it? Very good, enjoyed that one. Right, let's give, uh, 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 maybe try another two games, I think. Maybe three, see how we do for time. Let's have a look. Timothy is late for dinner. This sounds interesting. <laughs> Do 
go. I like the little character in this. Fairly small platforms to uh, negotiate your jumps with. You'll be so careful. And get another game that uh, can challenge the player. I can see a lot of thoughts being put into this game too. There's a lot of consistency within these levels. Uh, really very good. Okay. Oh, what's that purple thing in that top corner? Oh, am I dead? Yes. I'll have to come back and have a look at that again. I'm intrigued. Right, let's try another game. Which one should we go for? Let's go for Piggy. Piggy Adventure. Okay, I like my little piggy there I'm controlling. Very tiny. Can I get through that hole? No. That fooled me there. A lot of obstacles to uh, avoid here, so it's all about jumping at the right time. Oh, I fell down. At least I didn't die. I can't get through there. How do I get back up? Don't say I've broken the game. I'm sorry. Let's try and go back across the other side of the screen and see if that helps. Maybe it's a trap. Maybe I've sunk myself. I've killed myself. Oh well. Right, let's try another one. Very good game, that one, though. We'll have to come back to this one. Right, let's pick one more. Cat Jam. That sounds interesting. Nice loading screen as well. I certainly spent a lot of time doing these games. And I'll use my trusty joystick again. Ooh, hang on. I was giving Jonathan Caldwell a bit of credit there. Okay. Oh, what's that red thing up the top there? Ah, that's given me some points. Now that's the first time I played one of these games where I've earned some points by collecting things. But I said I'm only picking out a selection of games by random here, so I'm sure there'll be others. So I'm actually collecting points here. Collecting items, that adds an extra element to the mix. Very careful timing to do my jumps and to avoid the bad enemies. Yes, I got killed there. Yeah, this one's challenging. Very good. Oh, I'm not doing too well here. Yes, good game. Very good game. Let's see if we can get that last red bit item. 
Yes, 300 points. I'm impressed with this one. There's certainly been a lot of thought put into this game. Oh, he got me. Okay, game over. That's one I would definitely have to come back to. Anyway, that's it from me. A huge, huge congratulations to these young children. They've done an absolutely phenomenal job at uh, writing these games. Well done.